Hey, how's it going? My second open beta experience on Toontown Rewritten went well. The queue is now set to where if you disconnect from the line, as long as your internet comes back, you know, within five minutes, your, your spot will be saved. So you don't have to worry about disconnecting and being screwed over and having to um, wait all that time again. Of course, this doesn't fix the constant line jumping. I've gone from 17 hours to 43 hours, back down to 20 hours, then way back up to 50 hours. I was just at 17 hours last night, and now it seems to be back up to 46 hours as of current. The wait time I'm showing here is for my third play session. They also plan to open more beta spots so more players can participate in this experimental semi-open beta phase. So I decided to continue with the open beta to see if I could reach Daisy's Gardens with the 3 hour time spots they are given out. Now with that said, entering Toontown was much simpler this time and I had no issues with the launcher, no disconnections, and not much lag was present. This time around, I was going to knock out a truck ton of tasks within the 3 hours given. So the last task I left off with was to friend someone, which is always an easy task unless you're on Test Town, original Teen Town. I was then given a task to go talk to Clarabelle, which I thought was weird because I remember not seeing a phone last time I was in here. So I went to double check. Turns out the task is already done, and all I had to do was talk to the CQ dude again. Flippy was the next one on my task list. He sends me off to fight four cogs. Easy stuff. The first fight of this run happened to be a lucky one for me. I join this guy and get two cogs. Two down, two to go. My tune is pretty weak right now, so I knew I was better off joining fights rather than doing it on my own. I joined up with Zilly, here leaving me with one more cog. Now with just one left, I hit up this bottom feeder and move on back down the flippy. Next up is four boss cogs. I ran into four flunkies pretty quickly and finished this up in less than five minutes. Finishing up Flippy's task, I run off to Franz to choose my next gag. Then run off to Pete and so on. I don't want to bore you with the tasking details. It pretty much went smooth and had no issues so far. So if you haven't logged in yet and you're going to be logging in soon, you shouldn't have any problems so far. So I end up getting distracted after finishing Professor Pete's task by my first beta friend. And we just messed around for a little while. The cogs were playing follow the leader, so we joined in. Overall, you can expect to get your 3 hours of gameplay without any worry. If you focus on your tasks, you can get to Daisy's Gardens in about 5 to 10 play sessions. And since there's been talk about increasing the amount of people that can be in beta, you have a higher chance of actually getting your key, so I would recommend going for it. Everyone I've ran into on TTR so far has been pretty nice. So I don't think it's impossible not to find someone to help you with your tasking. Shoot, if you can find somebody to help you, you could probably get it done within two play sessions. Well, that's what I got done before my time ended. I got my level 3 gags and needed just a few more tasks to finish up with Toontown Central. Good luck getting your key, and I'll see you in the game.